Hello, hello, welcome, welcome, Roxana. How are you today? Oh, pretty 
Thanks. Are what you, you ready for your English class? Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> How do you feel today? I feel good, thanks. What did you do today? Can I learn another another um, phrase on oh, YouTube? Really? Is, what uh, phrase did you learn? A nice seeing you. Nice seeing you. <laughs> Nice seeing you. Nice seeing you. Okay, okay. You. See, yes. Nice seeing you. In what situation can you use this phrase? Nice seeing you. Uh, um, uh, in that, in this moment with you. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay. For the class. Nice to see you. Nice. Nice to see you. Okay, nice seeing you. And what about when you see a friend that you have not seen in a long time? Oh, yes. You know, and it's a surprise. Can... And, oh. you, and you see your friend shopping or something and you say, hey, nice seeing you. How have you been? Oh, Okay. That's that's another situation, right? Yes. Yes, I think. And uh, what did you do today? I went to well, well. I did Hello my Doris, house. how are you? Hi teacher, I'm fine then because I am um, start my holiday in my work really yes T today <laughs> yeah congratulations thank you <laughs> so tomorrow is friday no work no <laughs> what about you roxana do you work tomorrow yes I am going to work with my mother on the market. Oh, no vacation no. for Roxana. Only in the morning. No, no, no vacation. Okay. On the market, you you work all week, all Holy Week. Oh, okay. Alexander. Yeah. Uh, not not only on Friday. Yes. I Hello. Friday. <laughs> How are you? Uh, well, we are discussing about the vacation time. Roxana has uh -huh. to work. Doris is on vacation today. Hello. Okay. Yes. <laughs> nice for her. Yes. yes. Yeah. Nice for her. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What about you, Alex? Uh, you know, thanks to God, I have a lot of work and I uh, I work in vacation because I need to produce food for some people. Oh. Yeah, all vacation. Yes. Easy money. Easy. No, no. It's not easy <laughs> money, but it's money. Yes. <laughs> you know? Right, right now, I am come to my house because I finished the middle of the time, but uh, at the 12 a.m., 12, 15 a.m., I'm going to go again to the uh, enterprise. And what does your normal, regular time look like on uh, a daily basis, on a, on a normal day? Normal day is the 8 a.m. to five and a half is normal, but in this project is like a 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. and 12 a.m. to 5 a.m. Oh, wow. Yeah, we, are produce, we are produced at night. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. And how do you feel? Now that there are a lot of tourists coming to El Salvador. Uh, pretty good. 
really good because they're come here to uh, visit some places, a good places. But uh, I think in my case, we have a lot of work, and I I like to I like to be like a tourist. They have a time to to, to, uh, to vacation, but okay, maybe next time. But I, I think it's, it's good. It's good for us. The, there are many tourists in El Salvador because there is a money. This is economy. It's a moving economy, but it's good. So, I yeah. like it. I like it. Yeah. Excellent, Alex. Marvin, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, everyone. I'm excited in this class. How was your day? Um, the day was uh, as a normal day, busy, very busy. But today was not on meeting. Today was on the working on documents and uh -huh. Uh -huh. making some uh, connections with other people to continue helping others. Okay, okay. And what does your normal routine look like? Uh, on my normal routine, I I get up 5.30 at the morning and I and then I make uh, some issues and take my breakfast and go to the office. Uh, I arrive to the office at 8 a.m. and I start to um, looking the the planning the planning uh, the do, do the activities mm -hmm. for the day and make that all that we plan uh, works and the time and sometimes uh, I supervise to the work of my partner mm -hmm. and until the 12. Then at the afternoon, at the evening, mm -hmm. even um, I just, I don't know, um, mm -hmm. uh, checking the uh, documents okay. uh, until 5 p.m. Oh, okay, okay. And then what do you do? Do you go to the park? Do you go to the gym? Do you go to the movies? Do you go get a coffee with a friend? Uh, after the work, I like to stay at home and, and stay out the the house mm -hmm. because I have a backyard mm -hmm. with a, I don't know how to say hamaca. Hammock. Hammocks. Hammock. Yes. Hammocks. I <laughs> I you spend enjoy time. your hammock. Yes, I enjoy my hammock. I like to spend a lot of time here mm -hmm. because this is my second office because here I received the English class, English nice, class. Nice, yeah. nice. Here I I prepare some uh, ideas for the next day and mm -hmm, mm -hmm. watch videos, mm -hmm. watch movies on the computer. Mm -hmm. I enjoy this hammock. 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 Okay, okay. Excellent, Marvin. Thank you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Today, yesterday, we were looking at this vocabulary. Everybody listen and repeat. Ignores. Ignores. Identify. 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 Deal with. Deal, Deal with. with aggravated. 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 Avoids. 
A boy. A boy. A boy. Runs into. Runs into. Solving. 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 Causes. 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 So, this was the activity that we were looking at yesterday. In today's class, we are going to move forward and we're going to be looking at section 2.6, lesson objective. By the end of this section, participants will be able to use models to express degrees of certainty, obligation, advice, and opinions. Any questions? Number one. Can everybody hear? Suggestion? Advice? Yes. No? yes. Let me remind yes. you, the models may express degrees of certainty, obligation, suggestion, advice, or opinion. I suggest for you to stay and learn a little bit more. Model auxiliaries express many different meanings or moods. Models can express degrees of certainty. What's that noise? It must be the phone, almost 100% sure. It might be the phone, less than 50% sure. It could be the phone, less than 50% sure. Models can also express obligation, advice, or opinions. You must be on time for the interview. Obligation, it's very cold, you should wear a hat. Advice, everyone should visit Paris once in their life. Opinion. Use models to write reactions to these situations. You and your friend plan to meet, but your friend never arrived. Number two, you loaned a classmate a lot of money last week, but she still hasn't paid you. Hasn't paid you. Number two, you loaned a classmate a lot of money. Reactions to these situations. You and your friend plan to meet by... Okay, so in this activity, you are going to give examples. For example, you and your friend planned to meet, but your friend never arrived. Number two. But your friend never arrived. Number two. You loaned a classmate a lot of money last week. You loaned a classmate a lot of money, but she still hasn't paid you. So I want you to give me at least five examples and you're going to write them here in the discussion forum. You're going to go where it says titulo and you're going to write multiple uses, models, models, multiple uses. You're going to go here and you're going to write five examples. Number one. I think I should not have loaned Oscar so much money. He has not paid back a penny. Number two, I wonder, I could have taken another route. I would not be lost right now. And then you're going to go to enviar. Number three. 
you can write the same examples as your partners. Any questions? No. Okay. Let's do it. Hello, Roxana. Yes, please. Okay, Doki. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Okay. The key number. Let's see. This. This. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay. There is. Models. Moros multiply what? Do you remember the name of topic? Moros multiples uses. Uses. Okay. Number one. Do you have do you do you have a, a example or not? Mm, give me a second for thinking. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. The teacher. Hello, guys. Hello. Hello. Luis. Okay. The first one. Your screen. First one. Oh, the first one. Anna. Hola. The first one, I don't know. I have one, but I'm not sure you know, if it's, you if it's correct. Have, yes. I, I think. The first one. You should. I think. I, huh? I will do the first one. You should okay. study English. You yeah. should study English if you want to pass the course. For sure. It's good. I I have the with that sentences if uh, the should to is necessary mm -hmm. to. Hmm? What? Should study. You should study or should you uh -huh. should to. Well, you should study. Should study. Should study. Not two because it's a model. Uh -huh, you yes. don't need to use two. You should study. You should study. Uh, English. No. Whatever. 
You should study. If you want to pass the course. If you want to pass the, co the, the course. Yes. Then, other one. You must. You must take your pills, your vitamins. You should. No, you must take your vitamins. Must take your vitamins. Vitamins. Uh, to have a uh, good health or for how for your health i don't know it is to have a good health or for have a good health for your health okay i was thinking you must be on time in your work it's really easy. <laughs> Having good health. You should do exercise every day if you want to lose weight. Uh -huh. I have one. Mm -hmm. See? Uh, I think you should not eat pizza for lunch because it is unhealthy food. What? I think you should not eat pizza for lunch because it is unhealthy food. Yes. I ate pizza from dinner. <laughs> You should eat or pizza. It's not a good idea. <laughs> you should eat. You should not eat. Not eat. You shouldn't. Uh, you shouldn't eat. You shouldn't eat pizza for lunch because it is unhealthy food. Unhealthy is correct? Yes. Yes, I think. Okay. Now I think that we will. We have an obligation. We don't have advice, right? Yes. Uh, you must. You must pay attention to the. That sentence is a way thinking. <laughs> what? You must pay I attention think in the class. In English you must class. Pay. <laughs> yeah, but I, I have an but my sentence is you must pay attention to the sign when you drive. Oh, okay. 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 Something like that. Sign. Las señales, yes. Sign. Okay. Yes. Sign. When you drive, yeah, another one. When you buy a device, a electrical device. When you buy an electrical device, you should read the instructions. Ah, yes.
When it's missing or we have all sentence? I don't know one, how many sentences he has to do. I or, or I remember five. Uh, I don't know. And I should we have two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of the platform. The first part of what? Hello, teacher. What are you doing? Hey, so we're going to be moving forward. Uh, we were looking at 2.7 multiple uses. You loaned a classmate a lot of money, but she still hasn't paid you. So we were writing four examples here. I think I should not have loaned Oscar so much money. He has not paid back a penny. Oh, I wonder, I could have taken another route. I would not be lost right now. Uh, Ivania, welcome. Zulma Yamilet, do you have some examples? No, we are no, we don't. Getting the class, just getting in class. Okay. What about what about Roxana? Do you have some examples? Yes, teacher, but I have only two because the others, my classmate wrote. That's okay. Uh, Ana Pineda, I remember. Or... That's okay. But I, I, but I sell, I say my examples. Mm -hmm. I think you should not eat pizza for lunch because it's, it is unhealthy food. Mm -hmm. It's good or no? It's excellent, <laughs> but I love pizza. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, the number two, you must pay attention to the sign when you drive. Okay. But I don't know if it's correct to say it's only sign or... Yes. Yes. Sign. Send about yes. sign. Yes, of course. Yes. And my classmate have another. Others. Who? Anna. For my groups. Okay. I said... When you buy an electrical device, you should read the instructions. Mm -hmm. Then I say, what did I say? Oh my God, I don't remember. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Another person wants to participate. Okay. Me, teacher. Or Alexander. No, go, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, I work with Alexander Munoz. Mm -hmm. Our examples. Number one, mm -hmm. you must clean the uniform every day. Mm -hmm. Number two, you must use your ID in the job. Mm -hmm. Number three, I could check your car in the morning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Number four, you should do exercise at least a uh, three minutes every day. And I, you should eat five times every day. Three Perfect. times really? Eat, really? And, <laughs> yes, and three times <laughs> normal. <laughs> <laughs> Only that, teacher. All right. Perfect. That is perfect. Okay, guys, any questions related to this activity? No. Now, for the sure, second... only have a, a, one a question. Yeah. When you use uh, this model for multiple uses, you need to introduce with the, with the phrase. For example, I wonder, I think, I... Correct. Important. Yes. That is correct. You need to start with a noun phrase with a static verb that's going to give you as a help 
to your main idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Okay. Let's look at verbs of beliefs. To express how certain or not you are about something. Can you hear? Hi. Let's look at the following yes. list. These are verbs of beliefs. Yes. They will help you express how certain or not you are about something. Ready? Repeat after me. Assume. Be certain. Be positive. Be sure. Bet. Dubbed. Figure. Guess. Have a hunch. Know for a fact. Suppose. Suspect. At this moment, do you have any questions related to this vocabulary? Any Can questions? Uh-huh. What is assume? Assume es como un suponer. Ah, okay. Supongo que está trabajando. I assume he is working. Okay. okay. Have a hunch. Have a hunch. Tengo presentimientos que fue al casino. I have okay. a hunch. He is in the casino. Okay. And, and now for a fact? I know for a fact. Estoy el mil por ciento seguro que fue al casino. Okay. Excellent. Huh? Bet. Bet. Te apuesto que fue al casino. Okay. I bet. He went to the casino. Okay, thank you. Yes. A figure. Figure is a pronunciation of that word. Figure. A ah, figure. A ah, figure. figure. Uh -huh. A figure is like when you say, ah, eso pensaba. <laughs> yeah, ah, that's what I figured. Okay, now you're going to give me at least five examples here in the discussion forum. Is this the same one? Okay, we already did that one. Let's look at 2.10, listening. Can you hear? Can you hear? No, no, right now. And no. welcome to Still Unsolved oh, Mysteries. Yes. No, yes. Tonight, no, we're yes. going to talk about the strange case of Betty and Barney. Hill. They were convinced that one night in 1961, they were abducted by aliens. Could this really have happened? Martha Stevens is here to talk about it. Martha, what's the story? Hi, David. Well, one night, while the Hills were driving home from a vacation in Montreal, they saw a bright point of light in the sky. Barney assumed it must be a plane or maybe a satellite, but Betty thought it could be a UFO. There were no other cars on the road, so Barney drove slowly so they could watch it. The object seemed to be flying beside them. Solo para aclarar este audio, guys, si ustedes lo buscan en algún canal or whatever, esta historia de Barney y, su, el, y el, la esposa está documentada, está hasta en los records del gobierno americano. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Hasta en los records del militar. All right, vamos a escuchar el audio y responder las preguntas. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Let's go. Yes. 
share the screen. Hey, who uh, wanna share? Okay. Mirna, okay. okay. Yes. Keep going. Point ten. Point ten. Okay. <laughs> I cannot listen. I cannot hear. I cannot hear. I cannot hear it. Mm, I put more volume. Okay. Yes. yes. Okay. No, I cannot hear. Oh. I will try. Let okay. me see. Try again. Listeners, Can you hear? welcome to Still Can you hear? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. We're going to talk about the strange case of Betty and Barney Hill. They were convinced that one night in 1961, they were abducted by aliens. Could this really have happened? Martha Stevens is here to talk about it. Martha, what's the story? Hi, David. Well, one night, while the Hills were driving home from a vacation in Montreal, they saw a bright point of light in the sky. Barney assumed it must be a plane or maybe a satellite, but Betty thought it could be a UFO. There were no other cars on the road, so Barney drove slowly so they could watch it. The object seemed to be flying beside them. Barney began to agree that it couldn't be a plane, so he stopped the car, and Betty said she saw about 10 creatures looking at them through windows in the object. And then what happened? As they drove quickly away, they suddenly felt tired and their bodies felt strange. Their next memory was driving on the highway again. They arrived at their home early the next morning. They said things were still strange. How were they strange? Well, they couldn't remember the drive home clearly. Betty found pink powder and stains on her dress. She had no idea where they might have come from. Did they contact anyone? Betty wrote a letter to the Air Force about their strange experience and about the terrible dreams she was having. The Air Force said Betty must have been having the dreams because she thought she saw a UFO. They said she couldn't have seen aliens. Betty and Barney were interviewed and hypnotized many times by doctors. They told stories about having medical tests on the spaceship. What did the doctors think? They doubted the story. They said dreams like this can be triggered by science fiction TV shows. Barney's description of the creatures matched creatures from a TV show. Doctors figured the Hills must have seen the show. Betty said Barney couldn't have seen the show because he worked in the evenings when it was on TV. Hmm. I suspect the doctors were right. That must be the real explanation. Well, maybe. There's one more thing. Doctors asked the Hills what time they left Montreal and what time they got home. The trip should have taken four hours. The Hills were amazed to realize it had taken them seven hours. What happened to the missing three hours? Good question, Martha. I guess that's why it's still an unsolved mystery. Okay, the first one is number one, right? Yes. Yes, number one. The hill saw an object flying beside their car. Their car. Number two. Number two. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes. Betty saw creatures, creatures looking at them from the object. Mm -hmm. Number two. Number three. Four. 
Betty found yeah. pink powder on her dress the next day. And that's the number six. The yes. doctor dubbed the... No, oh, the number four? Yeah, yes. number six. Four is six. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The doctor doubted the hill story. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Number five, uh, I don't know. Five, uh, seven. Seven, yes. Yes, oh, the, the aliens show. look just like creature from TV show. And the six is number eight. The mm -hmm. trip took seven hours instead seven. of four. Yes. Yeah. Well, I don't What do you think? Do you believe that is so true? I think it's not true. <laughs> I I don't believe in, in aliens. Yeah. Me too. I think Me. God created only the angels mm -hmm. on the heaven. Yes. And the people on, on, on the earth. Yeah, I don't believe on aliens too. I think it's maybe other kind of things, whatever, life for the, I don't know, uh, experimental, uh, well, how do you say, uh, nave? Or uh, Nave? avion or plane? I don't know. Plane. Yeah. Maybe. Young. Yes. Ground plane. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I think that uh, they have. Uh, they don't have a uh, very certain uh, proof. Or not. No. What? Proof, proof, prove us. Oh, yeah, I think. Yes. Yeah, maybe. It, the, the, all the we know are very secret. Uh, they have a lot of secret about. So, because maybe they have in, on secret because they don't know, they don't have uh, a proof. Yeah, or uh, sometimes uh, people invent or or see whatever object or lie and say it's an alien. Yes. But it's not true, I think. Yeah, or maybe they try to play with our minds, uh, telling us uh, what they want that we believe. Yeah, or I don't know if uh, I think uh, people have a image for the movies in their mind, and maybe they imagine. Maybe they something. Yes, got a uh, dreams related and... with the movie. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. I believe in God, and I think it's true. Yeah. But, but many people said it's a, uh, it's a, uh, it, God is uh, in at the university and in, in the book I study, and it's like a uh, God is like a uh, CPT or La Ciguanaba. It's a mito. Mito. I don't know how can I say it in English. But, Legend, yeah, but I believe in God and I think it's true for me. Um, yeah, yeah, for me too. 
and I believe of the Bible and, and all the Bible said. And is my my direction or my uh, for the all uh, whatever happened in that in that in this world, yes. the Bible explain. Yes, yes. And if the Bible that uh, doesn't explain something, doesn't exist, I think. <laughs> It yeah. doesn't exist. But it's my opinion. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. You I are right. I... I think the same is that the Bible doesn't mention about it. It don't exist. <laughs> yeah. Like, probably, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> But you have an idea about whatever thing in the world. The Bible is your life. Oh, how can of I say? Your life. Yeah, your life. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a way to live, you know, because you make a relationship with God and He, through the Bible, teach you how to live in the better way, in the way that you don't know bad things and you don't do bad things. And in the way you live is in love and do the good things. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the, the Bible show you no. what is what is bad or what is good for you, for you? Yes, yes. Because in this time, uh, the different group of people think about, uh, they make their rules and they uh, telling us what is normal, what is not, what is good, what is bad but according the way they think. Yes. Yes. According to their mind. Yeah. And there are a All right, let's check one more time. Alex, number Hello. one. Number one, the hill saw an object flying beside the car. The hills saw an oh, object flying, flying beside, beside their car. Perfect. Select somebody, Alex. Ivania. Ivania Romero, number two. Oh, Ivania is asleep right now. Sulma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Number two, very, very saw creatures looking at them from the object. Betty saw creatures looking at them from the object is correct. Number three. Doris. Number three, Roxana Mendoza. Okay, teacher. Betty found pink powder on the dress the next day. Excellent. Roxana, select somebody. Oh, Marvin? Marvin. Okay. The doctor doubt the hill story. The doctor doubted the hill's story is correct. Number five, Mirna Barahona. Right, so number seven, the aliens look 
just like results from a TV show. Perfect. The aliens looked just like creatures from a TV show. Perfect. Number six. Please, for me, one more time, Zulma. Doris. The trip took seven hours instead of four. Still. Perfect. The trip took seven hours instead of four. Excellent. Ding, ding, ding. Correct. 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 Any questions related to the listening activity at this moment? No, no right now. Okay. Let's move forward and we are going to finish section two today. Reading, reading. Let's look at the reading activity. The first section says, Amnesia spoils newlyweds bliss. Amnesia spoils newlyweds. Let's check it out. Amnesia spoils newlyweds bliss. What if the person you married forgot who you were? For one Texas couple, marriage became a blind date when the groom came down with amnesia days after their wedding. So you are going to read the text in pairs and answer the questions. Okay. Any qu any hey. questions? No, Let's no, go. One paragraph for each one. I, I start? Can I? Yes. yes, you can start. Okay. Okay. What is the person you married for God who you were? For one Texas couple, marriage become a blind date when the groom came down with an Anisha days after their wedding. Their wedding. Your turn. Amy, Amy and Sin McNuthlis noticed wedding days started well, but ended with a shock. One of Sin's good friends was in a coma because of a serious car accident. Never, never, heard, I know, I can't. Nevertheless, nevertheless. Amy and Ken and Sin decided to make their honeymoon trip according to plans. At the airport, Sin realized he'd left his wallet in their car after they parked. He said to Amy, I'll be right back, but he didn't return. Amy, Amy contacted the police who found Sin wandering near a motel three days later. He was confused and covered in bug bites. 
He had no idea who he was or who Amy was. Sin couldn't remember any personal details from his life, not even his Child. mother. Okay. Amy was no married to a man who be, be with, be with, I don't know, her a stranger, her as a, as a stranger. I wondered, 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 you know, is he going to remember me? How is our relationship going to work, said Amy. This was a big change after a six year courtship and plenty of shared memories. Plenty. I had to. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> I had to learn to ask him, can I hug you? I mean, that was hard, said Amy. Physiatrist, physiatrist Dr. Daniel Brown says, since anesthesia might have been caused by a series of stressful moments, like his friend's car accident. According to Dr. Brown, Sims' brain didn't connect with his identity anymore. He doesn't know who seen McNull McNully, Nulty in is and has no memories to help. It's sort of like if you forgot the name of a file you stored on your computer. You know it's there, but you can find it, said Brown. His memory is like that. Fortunately, the better time soon arrived the day before their first anniversary. I don't remember how they pronounce this word. Anniversary. Anniversary. Since memory flow floated back in an instant, he soon remembered everything, including their wedding. I remember showing cake in her face, said Sim. It was great. Sim built the experience as a change, as a chance to confirm the picked the, the right bride. I got to see how much she loves me, said Sin. We have a much stronger, closer bond from the experience. I couldn't have found a better woman to spend my life with. Okay, now we are going to answer the questions. The number one, Sin, Anesha, or Anesha? Amnesia. I don't remember how how teacher pronounced this word. Amnesia. Amnesia. She said amnesia. Amnesia began. Amnesia. Since amnesia began after he was in a serious car accident, is not is false, right? No. False. Because it uh, for the stress. I remember. Yes. Okay. Yes. Number two. It's your turn. <laughs> Sin shoved cake in Amy's face when he remembered who she was. Yes, true. No, it's false. No, 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 no. No, it's false. Yes. Yeah, it was just because, our, uh, because it, it wasn't when they were wedding. Yes, in their way. Yes. Not not when no, when he returned. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, number three. The anesthesia might have been caused by too much stress. It's true, right? True, yes. Okay, Sam, all are yes. correct. We got it. Yeah, we got it. Okay. Okay, but we have time. I don't know if we continue practice to reading again or I don't know. Yes, we can. 
you you start now change okay. that what if the person you married for, you married forgot who you were for one of for one text of couple mariage became a blind date when the, the groom came down with amnesia days after the wedding Ami and Singh McNulthis, Nulthis, wedding day started well, but ended with a shock. One of the Singh's good friends was in a coma became of a serious car accident. Nevertheless, Amy and Singh decided to make their honeymoon trip according to plans. At the airport, Singh realized he left his wallet in the car after date parked. He said to Amy, I'll be I'll be right back. But welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Let's look at number one. Sean's amnesia began after he was in a serious car accident. True or false? False. 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 Sean shoved cake in Amy's face when he remembered who she was. True or false? False. 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 The amnesia might have been caused by too much stress. True. True. Ding, 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 ding. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. All right, guys, we are finished with section number two. Please complete the midterm exam Saturday and Sunday. So Monday, we can start with section three. Bye-bye. Good night. See Bye. you. Bye. 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 Bye.